Hey, what's up guys? It's me, EM Drones, and I'm going to show you how to change your PIDs using the Race Flight Revolt Flight Controller and your Spectrum Radio. It's pretty easy. Um, you're going to need a Spectrum Telemetry Receiver and any compatible Spectrum Telemetry Systems Radio that could read the telemetry and a Revolt Flight Controller. So once you're plugged in you're gonna want to go to the right get to your PIDs menu and then you're gonna want to put both sticks down and inward to access the menu you're gonna see a little arrow to get to your roll and pitch you're gonna hold the stick to the right so you get the little star and then you're gonna want to go diagonally up to the top right corner to move up through the menu so yaw roll pitch PIDs then you get into your yaw rate roll rate and pitch rate and then just the general settings with the LEDs once you're in there I think that's the last one alright so, so to go back it's down and to the left so you diagonally you're just going up and down alright so let's say you wanna save something you wanna get into the menu alright so let's say I wanna save this to 200 so I'm going to move this up. So to do to change anything you you hold the the stick to the right for a second and then diagonally up. Once you're there, you go up or down. And then to the left to get out of that. Let's say I want to change this. I go up and down. All right. So if you want to save, you just come right here and you hold it to the right. Once you do that, it's going to save. And then to confirm that, we could double check by going up the menu and back down. All right, yeah, it saved it to 200. So now I could change it back down to 190. Hold that back down a second. And it saved that. Alright guys, I'm also going to show you how to set up RSSI using the Spectrum Telemetry Receiver. Um, Ladrib went through this on his video. So you're going to want to press down on the scroll button. You're going to want to get to where it says Telemetry. To set up Telemetry, it's so easy with the Revo. You just click on Auto Config and it literally does everything. So you want to get here to flight log, click on that, and you want to set this up to, he set up to 24s, so that I'm, um, basically when you get under 24% signal strength, you're going to get a, a really fast beeping tone and a vibration letting you know that, that you better turn back, if not you're going to lose it. So you get some kind of warning before you just drop out, and that's really good with the spectrum telemetry. If you also have a TBS race um, VTX, you could also change your 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 VTX channel band and power output through there. I use a an, an immersion RC Tramp VTX, and hopefully immersion and race flight get together and and get that going because I'm I know for sure that the Tramp can do it. But I hope that helps you guys and. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. Please, if you like the video, like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Race flight.